Hello there fellow NPCs, I am Corbin Scythe and today we're getting back into the Braid Awakening. Now this is right after I got back from the 10 day camping trip where I played a bunch of board games. And you, if you want to read about that, you can do so over on my coffee page. And uh, yeah, uh, so I don't quite remember exactly where I am because I've been focusing on the other stuff for the past one and a half weeks. But I did a bit of a checkup. We have escaped the dragon. We have some more evidence uh, regarding the drug that is making us happy. <laughs> and now we're back at the Vic Hotel. I don't remember why we're here. I remember us uh, telling everything to a random bystander at the cafe. But yeah, we'll see where it all goes. Let's go. Wow. It's been a while. May as well head on up. A minute later on the elevator. <sighs> Damn stupid heels. The redhead and thong and see through dress. Obvious what she is here for. No one we know. She looks pretty nervous. You okay? Excuse me? Sorry, don't mind me. But you should probably put that outfit on after you arrive, not before. Damn, I'm sorry. Y your first time? Don't worry, I'm not judging. You're not? Sorry, about a week ago may I may have. But I met a girl. Let me rephrase that. I met a woman who changed my perspective on many things. She does? This? She does. Hopefully not much longer, but that is her decision to make, not mine. Wow. You love this woman, don't you? Maybe. Hey, look. Just be careful. There are some nasty individuals out there. So I heard. This is just some old guy. I heard he's a sweetheart, so I think I'll be fine. That's good to hear. Well, this is my floor. You take care now. Yeah, you too. You should just invest in a large coat. <laughs> I'll pick one up tomorrow. Now. Okay, so this is where it all began. Now, please. Let this not be too awkward. Oh, is this where Mido is? Knock, knock. No, currently. So where's Mido? Well, didn't she take over the, apart uh, the apartment? Hey, Kurt. Currently. Look, it may not mean much right now, but I have what we need. I'm going to the press tomorrow morning. That's still not going to bring Stella back. It's not fair. She never did anything wrong. I know. I'm doing the one thing I know that can stop them. You need to be careful. I lost one too many friends as is. I promise you, I will. I think I need a hot shower. Just to take my mind off things. Again, just be careful out there. I've already had too much pain for a lifetime. Don't add to that. The sound of running water can be heard behind the bathroom door. Hey, Carly? Yeah, Kurt? Where is Mido? Can I come in? Nothing. Where is Mido? Yeah. Where is Mido? I guess she, she went down to the pool. She mentioned she wanted to go for a swim earlier. I not question is what is the um what's his point behind this? What what does it want? What he what does it want to be comforting or does it want to be a pervert? <clears throat> May I come in? Wait, what? Can I come in? After the day, I need you. The door is unlocked. I don't know if I can do this, but... Ah, I see. 
Well, as I said, I do feel like I'm much closer to Carly than anyone else. She might be the main love interest of the game. Uh, but yeah, how well she is. Carly, I didn't say it last time. But I think I'm in love with you. You are? You're all I have thought about these last few days. You are what drives me. My inspiration. My reason to keep on this crusade. If it wasn't for you, I don't know where I would be. I love you too. Come here. I need to feed you in my arms. Good day. Please turn around. Beautiful. Hold me. Give this day something good to remember. I'm scared, Kurt. I'm here. You have nothing to be scared about. You better kiss me. Grab me. Just pick me up. I want you. Which means I will be seeing you guys real soon. And we're back. Yeah, very passionate. And they explored, uh, well they didn't explore anything new really. We did that uh, some time ago with Stella. Hmm. And yeah, we got the achievement, a one true love. Which uh, just goes to show that Carly is the main love interest in all of this. I like it. It's one thing, uh, it's different from when uh, one of the characters is just... A big hoe in high school, you know. <laughs> uh, that that's a trope. Uh, but this is actually a prostitute. A uh, some that is not common, as far as I know. Maybe in these darker themed games. But yeah, uh, falling in love with a prostitute, you know. It's a very different kind of kind of sweet in a sense. But yeah, let's go. I know you need to go. I wish I could stay. You know I can't. Just do right by Stella. I want to see them all behind bars. I'll make sure of it. Look, I do need to go. Good luck, Kurt. Please be careful. I have a bad feeling about tomorrow. I will. You watch over me and stay safe. A few minutes later downstairs. Oh right, we could do, mm, choose to not go in there, which I means, which means that we would be going to Mido, I guess. Time to go check on you and Christina. It's late. They will surely be asleep by now. Speaking of which, I have to do that when I get there. At least I know Carl and Mido are safe. Oh no! Well, well, well. Look who came out to play. Your poor little friends are all alone upstairs. Oh, you bitch. Why don't we go play a little game with them? Where are you? I just found a detective leaving the Vic. I was just about to pay his girlfriend a visit. Later. Right now you need to follow him. We need to know what he has on us. This time, don't do anything rash. Click. Shit, I was planning to have fun with those two. Some other time. Now, what do we do about you? Anything, Daddy. I want you to forgive me. Ooh. Well, we all know the drill here. I'll see you guys real soon again. And yeah, in the middle of that, Eddie joined and essentially said, please don't hurt, uh, what's her name? Judy. Please don't hurt Judy. Please don't hurt Judy. And then he joined in. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Also, Eddie showed up uh, to say uh, that the doctor is gone. He has to run away. And tomorrow... He is going to go with the dragon to find the doctor and make sure he cannot squeal to the base. I think it's like that. Now, let's continue. 
About time. Now I can put my feet up. Check on Yuri, check on Christina, go to sleep. We check on both of them. Poor thing. I hope this mess will be over soon. <laughs> that is not a, uh, something to sleep in. Strange. Couldn't guess by looking at her while she's sleeping how wild she is. Damn, what would Carl think? Maybe I, should, maybe I should just go lay down. Yeah, exactly. Approach her means we're gonna have some fun time with them. But I don't think that's something I want now. I know we've been on the drugs. Uh, but we're also kind of aiming that desire, I feel like. Yeah, what the hell, let's see where, where it takes us. If it goes to a scene, we'll see what happens there. Uh, damn, cute, cute ass on her. Damn, what would Carly think? Maybe I should just lay, go lay down. I can at least look, go back and sleep. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Jesus, what a day. And also, I haven't played for one and a half weeks. So I'm not in the same mood. If you think my choices here are weird, it's because I haven't been in the right mindset for this game for uh, 10 days. Maybe I can figure this <clears throat> next day. Oh, I gotta slow down. I'm too old for this shit. Here's some commotion in the kitchen. God, I hope they're making food. Could go for that right now. Then after the free city press. Beautiful view to walk in on. Morning. It's a bit after 12. You really slept for a while. You know today is important. Okay. I guess. <laughs> Fine. Uh, thanks for shaking me back into position here. As I said, I'm not in the right mindset, but this, yeah, sure. This is taking me back into the right mindset, all right? <laughs> you needed sleep. Did I? Yes, you did. You look beat. I didn't want to bother you. Hey, guys, at this... I see discretion has gone out the window. You two want something to eat? I could go for some French toast, I think. Perhaps it's not my place, remember? Let's take a look through them with fridge. Oh, what is it? There's barely anything here. Don't worry about it. I, it can wait. You sure? It's okay. We can grab something on the way. Look, kiddo, I'm just going to get it cleaned up. I'll meet you two out here in a few before we head off to the newspaper. Let's just actually check. Beauty, 10 1, so that's uh, love, I guess, not lust. Stella is dead, 2 4. Carly, 11 4. Okay, so 10 maybe is the love score, a uh, love uh, uh, bar. Christina, 2 2. Mido, 7 1. How the hell did you score so, low, score so low with Christina, though? That feels good. I wish I could stay here for hours. So let's see the appeal Mira has with it. Meanwhile... It has to be a second. It's right around the corner. I think Kurt wants us to stay here. Look. It'll just be a minute, I promise. Get some bread, eggs, and a few other things. A few minutes later, outside. Is she gonna be shot down by the dragon too? Well, it seems pretty rough these last few days. Hopefully. This will cheer him up a bit. Not to mention, I am starving. Fucking French toast. A few minutes later... That didn't take long. 
she's whistling. Is that Eddie? Please don't be Eddie. That is Eddie. Hey! Asshole! And that's the dragon. Damn it! Can't do back now. Next time, look where you're going. Oh, what the hell? Prick. Doesn't even apologize. What is it with people? Christina, I presume. Do you run, you little bitch? Help! Let's get to the street. Almost there. Ha Holiday. Alex. Hold it right there, girl. This damn bitch can run. I don't know anything. Just let me go. But Hollis was kind of a good guy, right? Please? First lie. Don't test me. <sighs> now, you're going to answer my question, you little snack. And don't you lie to me again. I don't know what you want. Good. You got her. Now what? F***ing cops. I know that the ticket is in that building you left. This is what you will tell me. What apartment? F*** you! It doesn't work that way, girl. Now, tell me what I need to know, then maybe I won't curve you up. Apartment 1012! That's not her duty, she has no idea. Ah, oh, crap. Hollis is also one of the bad guys. Well, but he was kind of acting like a good guy. Hmm. Too bad. I saw a, a glimmer of hope in him, and I thought that is where this thing was going. So now, what the f do we do with you? Take her with us. Sounds good. If she is lying, I got her on the spot. Wait. What is it, Piggy? If she comes with us, she could alert them. My car is over in the alley. Let me throw her in the trunk. Perhaps you're right. The girl is all yours. What are you going to do with me? Would you just keep moving? Now get lost. Wait. What? I have enough shit to deal with right now. I don't need you to worry about some random girl as well. I can just go. Are you f***ing dense? Get the hell out of here! Just keep running. Now let's get this shit over with. A minute later. What the hell are you getting? I, he said I had to work with you two. He didn't say how. God, are you nuts? People will see. Let them. Oh shit, hold on now. What the bloody fuck? Watch where you point that thing. This is just a warning. Stay out of my way. That detective is mine. We're on the same side here. F*** me. <clears throat> are you two done? All is? Can you see I'm a bit pissy? I am only here because of you. You want me to help or not? As for you, how about we don't cause a huge racket? That girl at the clothing store lived, you know. She ID'd you to a T. Unlike you, I don't have a death wish, nor do I want to see the inside of a jail cell. So let's not be stupid here and just get this f***ing thing done right. Meanwhile... Okay, are you ready to head out? Soon. Christina went out to grab some food. She what?! She said she would be quick. We're leaving now. What about Christina? Forget her! We're leaving! Go get dressed, quick! What the hell? Why would you do that? Damn it, Christina, why? Fuck it. Gotta get this to the press. Remember, in and out. 
Now we're getting real close here. Less attention, the better. That gun doesn't help. Fuck off. I gave Kurt enough chance to get out of this. Shit, the southern bastard. This is on him. Edit, this is crazy, it's broad daylight. Maybe we should rethink this. This isn't the time to chicken out all this. If he got to the dock, he needs to be stopped. Now. Why aren't we waiting on Christina? Cutie, she betrayed our trust once. Her leaving like that? I can't risk it. Worst case, she sits up there by herself for a while. Hurry up, you two. What's the plan? We're going quick. Storm the place, then part ways. Eddie, this is too fucked up. You listening, Eddie? Why the f are we here? Get your f***ing hands off me. Don't make me shoot you both. It's time. There was a firefight! Beauty. And how it is said, we are not waiting. Could have left a note. Something. Christ. Get down quick! Who is that? Someone not very nice. Whatever happens to me, promise one thing. Take this bag and bring it to the newspaper. Okay. Promise me! I promise! Beauty. They're headed this way. When I get the chance, I'll get that door open. When I do, you need to run as fast as you can. We know you're here, Kurt. Give us uh, what you have and you're free to go. That's not part of the plan! Detective, you won't see another dawn. However, if you want the girl to live, come out now. Whoo! Fuck me! Kurt, hold up! Go to hell, Eddie! You were always a lousy shot, Kurt. Now we get to have fun. You could have made the situation so simple. But simple is boring. Show me that pretty head of yours. The sound of police sirens can be heard in the distance. Eddie, where'd you go? Right now! You f***ing cowards! It's now or never. Boom. Boom. Oh, no you don't. Guard! Come to me, duty. Now run. Get in. Whatever you do, don't lose that bag. Get in. The screech of tires on hot pavement. Oh, no. God, slow down! Can't, she won't stop! So, she has a, a car and a motorcycle with her? Because in her car she had the shotgun. Oh shit, Kurt. Go faster! Fuck, where is the gun? Woo! Jesus H. Christ! Why is she slowing down? What the f Start your stupid thing! <laughs> it's out of gas! <laughs> oh, oh, please tell me that's uh, Holly's doing, because it's not Christina's doing. What is she doing? Just go! Yep, screw this, hold on! Ah, f it! Thank God. Kurt! Oh, you did. No, 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 no. Don't pass out. Well, I'm not gonna die, am I? Kurt! Oh, we ran her over. Get up! Please! 
Damn, that's some action-packed uh, uh, car shades there. You did. <coughs> Are you okay? I'm here. I'll be okay. What about you? Don't worry about me. I need you to go. Oh, take that bag and get to the free city press. Kurt, you need help. I can't leave you like this. You can. And you will. Cops will be here soon. You can't let them catch you. Just get to the press. Okay. That's it. Get out of here. Good work, kiddo. Don't look back. <gasps> me. Some da same damn shoulder. You can't get rid of me that easily, detective. And it's uh, cut open in just a perfect way that the nipple shows. Oh, of course it is. You think you can take what was mine and not deserve retribution? It was my world and you smashed his f head in with a rock. I wanted to make you suffer. But watching you die before me just works just fine. I'm going to cut you open. Come on, Kurt. Get out! Ugh. This time there is no running. <laughs> this time you die. Now meet your fate. Woo! Ah! Ah! Crack. Not today! Bonk. Cuffs off even more blood. Ugh. I f***ing shot you. Your boyfriend's made the same mistake. Husband. What does it matter now? He's dead. I presume I will be shortly. The sound of sirens get closer. Not much time now. Do it, detective. You know I won't stop. I don't know what exactly happened to you, but I wish it on no one. You know exactly what happened to her! Eddie told you! Spare me the needed pity. Don't just stand there shitting shit. Do it! I do think we need to kill her. Because, as she said, you know I won't stop hunting you down. That's for Stella. And all the others you have hurt in the past. <gasps> Cops are almost there. Strike it down, Dragon Slayer. Ugh. I have to get out of here. To the Vic. I need to get Carly. Alright, Kurt. No time to waste. After a few minutes escape and crash. <laughs> Not much further. God. I'm almost there. I'll be there soon, Carly. Gert. Hold it right there. Me. Eddie. <laughs> what the hell? Why? Can't let you go, Kurt. I know you got to the dock. I know you got evidence on us. Shit, I can't let you do it, man. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Question is, get explain what he's doing is wrong. Explains exactly what's going to happen. Get angry with him. Doesn't explain anything, really. So I want to check what that means. All this time I thought you were my friend. Just another lousy two-bit piece of shit. No. But he is uh, confronting him. Which is kind of what I thought would happen. So yeah, explain what he's doing is wrong. We're trying to save his life here. All this time. I thought you were my friend. 
I should have known better. So now what? Kurt. Eddie, you're not a murderer. This isn't you. You won't pull that trigger. Maybe I am. Mason, that was you. He called the police about Stella, didn't he? You just happened to be the one that showed up to talk to him. I can see it in your face. It was you. It wasn't like that. He wouldn't listen. I told him that there would be no way to pin it on Mr. Young. He should forget it and move on. Then, with his guard down by the window. <laughs> Just a little push. That's all what that was needed. Let gravity do the rest. If they charged on Wu, he would have cracked like an egg. I had no choice. You were a good cop once. Now look at you. Kurt. If you're going to do it, Eddie, then make him beg. Oh, it was Hollis who sang that. F***ing Hollis. As if this couldn't get any worse. Yes, had to start poking around there and you. You really f***ing sub, you know that? Yeah. Yes, doing my job, you. <laughs> Mention sister. Unless we can say that she is working for daddy, then he's just going to shoot me. Let I want to see what happens. Not much time left here, but let's see. So you're going to help the chicken shit kill me? Why would Leon think of her brother the mur- Why What would Leon think of her brother the murderer? This has to stop, Eddie. Oh? Oh? We've gone far enough already and we owe these bricks nothing. Ooh! Am I to converting both of them? That's awesome! Let's go with that! Gert, get up. Get back here, you coward! Wallace. Okay, Gert. Get up. <laughs> Carly. Be there soon. I'll make it. I promise. Oh. oh. There it is. I'm going to make it. The sound of traffic drowns everything around. Hey, buddy, okay? Out of my way. I need to see your face one more time. Sir? Sir! Quick, call an ambulance! Come on, let's go. I'm here, Carly. Carly! Oh. Carly! Quick. Huh? <gasps> Miro, call an ambulance! God, you damn fool! What happened to you? I had to see you again, even if it has to, even if it was the last thing I did. Kurt, you're going to be okay. I'm here. God damn, I love you so much, you southern bastard. Just hold on. They said an ambulance is already here. Well, that's a damn ag fast ambulance. Carly, look at me. Let me see those beautiful eyes. I love you. More than anything. Perfection. Good. Oh no, no you don't! Alright, lift! We have a gunshot wound passed through, the patient is going into shock, heavy loss of blood. I need him prepped stat. Now oh, you again. Listen to me, you're going to be alright. Just hang on. Doctor, we're losing him. Meanwhile. 
The sound of rushing footsteps are drowned out by the city's traffic. Hey, careful where you're going! Sorry! Hello? Can someone? I need help! Ah! <laughs> ah! Hey, are you okay? I so want to end this episode! So I'm going to do that. She is going to talk to the uh, uh, reporter and the next episode is possibly going to be the last one. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And thank you Joseph for donating directly to my coffee page. If you guys want to support me, there are several ways to do that. And the way to find it all is through my card linked down in the description. See you guys in the next one. And remember, just because you're not the main character, it does not mean you're not important. Goodbye everyone.